Hello guys, my name is Light and today we're playing some Alpha Bat Company 2. Now, I want to make a little video about this little weapon right here, the M1A1. This thing is overpowered. Pretty overpowered. I've been playing this game for not too long, like I don't know, a couple weeks. But I know one thing, I am not good at this game. I am absolutely horrible at it. And yeah, I don't have to say about this game. No. And that's really fun. I, I like it, and I say it's worth the worth the pickup. But hey, we're taking stagger fire! Recently Take I got cover! this weapon, the M1A1. The M1A1, which is a Thompson. This thing is really good. Like, I wouldn't say this really as good as the other weapons in the assault, but I've been doing the recon class because I have put nothing into it to see default weapons suck. But I leveled up, I got this, and that's basically, that's basically, has been happening a lot. Not a lot per se, but it's happened a lot more than it normally does. Okay, yeah. Please stop hitting me, please stop hitting me, please stop hitting me, please stop hitting me. I will hit you Okay, back. I got eyes on some enemy infantry. Oh. No, Alright, so if you don't know, this game is... Yeah, I already said it. But... Okay. The Thompson is a... All class... All class gun you get at level... 10. Level 10. Game. And that's how we're going to get into that one actually get it, which is probably not going to happen for a few years, but even then, it's probably not going to happen for a few years. Anywho, oh, okay, that's what I'm This gun is, ex is really, really, really good. Seriously. I got... I normally suck at recon, right? Okay? I normally suck at recon. I can do that, but that's it. Yeah! <laughs> now that's what I like to see. Now anyway, normally I suck with this weapon, with, you know, this class, because the sniper rifles are pathetic. Like, seriously, you'd expect the sniper rifle to, you know, get a, you know, a guy in one hit, it takes four. From my experience. So two headshots. That's not normal, right? That's not normal. So in other games I've played, even TF2, that's a one-shot kill. Especially if fully charged. But this one, I'm pretty sure that I'm going to be able to get a lot more... Okay, kill if I get a lot more. I'm going to look at the stats, because I'm going to tell right? I mean, I'm running a gaming channel. I'm going to look at the stats of a gun right me. Now, this... Now, as you can see, its damage and accuracy are exactly the same, and they're very low, actually. But the rate of fire is... Good. It's actually really good. And it's not like a... It's not like... The psycho, where it's like... Spam click with one button. It's... It's just you hold it down. It's basically fully auto, not simple. Okay, look, there's a guy, and I'm dead, but... Shows how good I am. I can see people working on this. Oh, it's probably going to take me like forever to get this until it's so good. You know, because you're telling me. I did not know what was going on. The more you know. I put a grenade. But yeah, as I. That's probably all for this episode. I'm probably going to give you a series, like, that's a bad thing to weapon. Uh. Weapon reviews, I guess. Weapon reviews, I guess. But, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed episode 1 of Battlefield Bad Company 2 Club Reviews. And I hope to see you guys in the next episode. Bye bye!